HSC TV and HSC News are public forums for student expression. Students make all content decisions and opinions expressed do not represent those of HSC schools or the Board of School Trustees. Good afternoon, Royals. I'm Grace Godish. And I'm Ben Atchison. News your school newscast for February 9th, 2017. Today's announcements are sponsored by Kathleen Cheely Photography, Class of 2018 Juniors. Apply now through March 1st to become a part of the model representative team at Kathleen Cheely Photography, because you deserve the senior pictures you've always imagined. Excited for what the new year brings in? Stay tuned for this clip about new movies, music, and shows that are up and coming in 2017. The new year brings in new movies, music, and shows. Many students are anxiously awaiting for their favorites. We decided to ask three students what they are most looking forward to in 2017. 2017 is going to be a big year for movies. I'm a sucker for Marvel movies, so I'm looking forward to a lot of the big Marvel movies that are coming out, especially Spider-Man Homecoming. I'm really looking forward to that. And also, I just recently saw the trailer to the new Transformers movie, so I'm really looking forward to that. Um, well, every year I'm always looking forward to the Project Runway seasons because, like, they really inspire me and get me in my creative mood for like when I sew and stuff like that. I'm also really looking forward to Stranger Things off of Netflix because first season was so good. I like finished it in one day literally, but I know a lot of people are really excited for it. This year I've seen a lot of ads for that Split movie and it looks really creepy and good. I recently finished all seven seasons of Shameless. They start filming season eight in May. I'm excited for season 8 to then roll out later this year. I'm also excited for season 3 of Grace and Frankie to come out. It's one of my favorite Netflix series and I hope to see a new season coming out. I'm excited for SZA and Kehlani's new album coming out early this year. They both have really unique sounds and I'm excited to hear their music. I'm also hopeful to hear new music from Lord and Lana Del Rey because they're two of my favorite artists and I hope that they have albums coming out. With HSC TV, this has been Christina Poets and Mia Lambert. In your school news, this weekend, Abigail Ross and Miles Moser will be traveling to the semi-state to compete for our school's bowling team. This past weekend, Abigail placed 11th out of 16 at regionals and Miles placed 4th out of 15. Great job and good luck to both of you. There will be a military history club meeting today in Mr. Mayor's room, J224, after school. All students are welcome to attend. Ping Pong Club is meeting during Smart Period this Monday in the weight room across from the athletic office. All are welcome to join the fun. Please come to J130, Ms. Riley's room, to pick up your pass sometime on Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday. Again, come and play ping pong with us on Monday during Smart Period. Be sure to swing by J130, Ms. Riley's room in the CCA, sometime today or tomorrow to get your pass. Royal Students for Life next club meeting is Monday, February 13th in A106 from 3 to 4 p.m. They will be watching a video and having a related discussion which does require parent signature form. Snacks and drinks will be provided and everyone is welcome. Any HSC Young Life student interested in attending the Pacers game this Saturday can sign up and pick up a ticket for $25 in Miss Kitchen's room, F129, through Friday. The ticket includes transportation at 530 on the west side of the building on Saturday. Don't forget to sign up for Just Dance Marathon at lunches. This video game competition is jointly sponsored by the Video Game Club and Riley Dance Marathon. It is happening Thursday after school from 330 to 530, and there will be free pizza and prizes for the winners. HSC, let's celebrate our Royal family with Winter Sports Week, February 13th through the 17th. Sign up now to play in the Dodgeball Tournament on Wednesday or the brand new Euchre Tournament on Friday. Forms are available in Mrs. Carson's, Ms. Kernow's, Ms. Hunt's, or Mrs. Matthias's room. Also, dress up and show your spirit. Monday is Lazy Day, Tuesday is Valentine's Day, Wednesday is College Day, Thursday is Disney Day, and Friday is Royal Pride Day. Before we go to your sports news, here's a quick edit on Purdue's Glee Club, who is having a concert here tomorrow. Purdue's Men's Glee Club will join us tomorrow in the Leonard Theater. You can get tickets at the choir office or at the door. Proceeds will benefit HSC's choir department. See you there! The girls' swim team competes in, in the state this weekend at the IU Auditorium. They compete tomorrow at 5.30 and Saturday at 9 a.m. Good luck to everyone competing. A reminder that boys' basketball competes tomorrow night at Carmel at 7.30. This is a huge game. Come out and support your Royals. Don't forget to tune in to tomorrow's newscast to check out how prom is planned and what is going on behind the scenes and to get ready for prom in April. We are going to leave you today with a check-in from the Black Student Union and additional information in honor of Black History Month.
This is an open letter to our history. Our history, black history, did not begin in chains. It began at the origin of human history itself. It began in Africa, with paved roads, working toilets, mansions, glass windows, sculptures, and paintings. It began with libraries, full of books. It continues when our people mapped, calculated, and erected some of the greatest monuments ever, like the pyramids, the Sphinx, and the Oblis. It is where calculus, trigonometry, and geometry can all trace their origins back to. It was where the ancient Egyptians, arguably one of the most influential civilizations of all time, It begins with Mansa Musa creating one of the first systems of provinces and territorial mayors and governors. The march of slavery did demonstrate the power of the black people, but that is not the whole of our history. Our history did not begin in chains. That's all we have for you today, HSC. Have a tremendous Thursday. Follow HSC TV on social media for more news and school updates.